Hello ladies and gentlemen, Comic World here, and how well do you know Thor? Alright guys, so in this video we're going to talk about some fun facts about Thor. So um, to get started with Thor, we're going to go over who he is and um, some um, abilities that he has, and then we'll get right into the fun facts. So Thor is the Asgardian god of thunder and possesses the enchanted hammer, hammer Milliner, which grants him the ability of flight and weather manipulation amongst his other superhuman attributes. Thor has superhuman speed, agility, and reflexes enable him to de deflect bullets with his hammer. Like all Asgardians, he has immunity to all earthly diseases and some resistance to magic. Exceptionally, powerful magic can overwhelm Odin's enchantment that transfers transforms him between Asgardian and mortal, mortal forms. Okay, so here are the fun facts, guys. Thor made his first ever appearance in issue uh, 83 of Comic Book Journey into Mystery, published in August 1962, created by Stan Lee and drawn by Jack Kirby. This isn't really a fun fact, but I mean, it's a fact, and it's kind of a cool fact to know, like, when, um, uh... Well, superheroes uh, made their first appearance and by who they were made by. Um, Alright, the original plan for Thor's movie ad adaptation was to use both the uh, mythological character Thor and his human alter ego Donald Blake and crippled American doc a crippled American doctor. Um, this They were actually like um, thinking about doing this and um, if you see the first Thor movie you'll see that like uh, when, what's her name? Jean Foster, um, it, when she's giving him the shirt it's, it actually says Donald Blake on, on the shirt. So, I mean, I thought that was kind of cool that they did that. But, yeah. Another fun fact is that Thor and his ilk, ilk aren't actually gods. They're just incredibly powerful beings who consider themselves godlike to that end. They're not actually immortal. In the comics, Thor and his fellow Asgardians maintain their power and vigor by regularly, regularly eating the golden apples of Adun, which also have... Th have the added benefit of keeping the doctor away, you know, so, some people, some, actually a lot of people think that God and his, um, people like Asgardians are gods, but they're not, or I mean, Thor and his, uh, oh yeah, Thor and his, and the Asgardians are gods, but they're not actually gods, they're just like really, really powerful people that live really, really long lives, give or take 7,000 years, you know, so, um, that's a misconception right there, Thor, and, oh, okay, we're red. Thor's ride. Thor's ride. Ah, I love my bad. Thor rides a mighty cosmic chariot pulled by two goats named Tooth Nasher and Tooth Grinder. The mystical goats were were a step beyond your common verily cute chewer. They could be reborn if they were if they were eaten. That is kind of weird and kind of cool at the same time. But imagine that, like you see in the movie, like Thor or Thor: The Dark World, him just riding on like. A chariot with like two goats, two goats pulling him. That'd be hilarious to watch. Like, people would just make give him crap for it. I think, but I mean, that's kind of funny, and that's kind of cool that the goats can uh, reborn if they were eaten. I mean, but then again, who would eat a goat, right? Well, so that's all for fun facts for today, guys. If you like the video, make sure to subscribe and like. Hit that like button right there, right there. Like, like, like. If you want to see more videos, click on that annotation right there, and it'll take you right to. But for today, that's all, and as always. Keep on marveling.